this video, I'm going to be showing you the best coverage in Madden. This is kind of the meta defense that pretty much everybody's using uh, in some way, shape, or form. It can be done out of a lot of different plays, uh, a lot of different, a lot of different formations. I think the best defense to teach this out of is the dollar defense. And the reason why I like to teach it out of dollars is because I think dollar is the most, uh, it's just the best defense for coverage in this game. So how we're going to set this up here real quick is make sure in your audibles you have the play cover six, Willie, DB fire two, edge blitz three, and strong safety zone blitz. Your coaching adjustments, you want auto flip off and auto alignment on base, and you don't want any zone drops set. Now, if you want to get my full... Uh, any of my full ebooks that are in our school community. Our school community is going to be linked in the description below. That's where you get access to everything. All of that stuff, uh, you can get access to the whole site there for just 10 bucks. So we're just going to flip double safety go. And the reason we're doing that is primarily for having this so that we can always use her, the right side of the screen linebacker. And the way that they're going to set this coverage up is this is a quarter quarter half coverage now typically with quarter quarter halves you're going to play halves like it would be like this quarter cover six willy you would play a cover two sink on one side and then you would play a cover four on the other side okay now the reason that we're actually going to invert this is due to the effectiveness of soft squat zones so if you think about what a soft squat zone is going to do really well a soft squat zone is going to do a really good job of carrying any kind of corner route from the bunch side. Um, specifically, the most popular form of a corner route to the bunch side, which is some type of uh, some type of like streak corner post. This is kind of the meta combo, and they might stem this corner down, but it's basically this, right? If you take a look here to the right side of the screen, you're going to see that this soft squat will do a really good job of defending that even though this is a four strong um, a four strong defense another little quick tip with soft squats in my opinion they play really really good if they're backed off compared to if they're pressed so this time we'll do this out of edge blitz three just to show you you can do it out of the different blitzes and dollar so we're going to soft squat this outside corner on the on the bunch side we're going to vert hook this slot corner on the bunch side. We're going to deep half this safety on the bunch side. This is going to help kind of help quasi defend seam streaks pretty well because he's in the box. It's also going to help kind of protect over the top for the deep pass. We're going to then inside quarter this outside or this left side safety. You can outside quarter this this left side corner if you want to you can leave him in a third or you could put him in a deep half the deep half will do a really good job of helping protect against the one play touchdowns and the whole idea here and then we'll hard flat this outside guy uh, but the whole idea for this defense is this inside quarter is a player that we can switch stick on if they're running that meta combo um, or really any combo with a bunch crosser so you're going to see here for example, I'm just going to use her the same streak. I see that there's that post. I could switch stick onto this guy, and then I have my soft squat over the top for defending the corner route. So this just does a really good job of shutting down um, a lot of the meta combos that you're going to see out of a bunch set. I think that this is probably the best base defense against the bunch. Now, what we can do if we want to, another little tip with this, is you notice how that yellow zone on the left side really didn't do a good job of playing the drag. So one of the things that I like to do is if I am anticipating a backside drag or something, a couple different things you could do with your user. You could just man your user up to this backside player. So like if we were in uh, Edge Blitz 3, for example, we, we could just man this guy up like this. And I'll actually show that because that's kind of a neat, a, a neat little adjustment. So basically what we're doing is we know we're going we're gonna to switch stick on any crosser. As we go, oh, we see a crosser, we switch stick, and then we have this cross man on the solo. It's not a bad way to do it. Um, but the other thing that you can do here is you can 
you can go to a shaded underneath yellow. So what I would do is I'd call my play, I'd immediately shade underneath, right? Or I would put a vert hook out here and then shade underneath if I wanted to do it that way. And then we'll kind of go about our adjustments like we were talking about. And now what you're gonna see here is if they run kind of that standard combo, then what I'm gonna see from this three rec is he's gonna play a little bit more aggressive underneath. So you'll see here, he kind of lurks that drag underneath a little bit better this time. So that's one little thing that you can do if they are throwing this underneath drag consistently. Um, you can use that just shade underneath and you see how, yes, it's open for a second, but that guy is gonna rob down and take that away but you still get a nice match, a nice soft squat zone on that outside player. I wanna thank you for watching this video on how to stop bunch. You can use this specific coverage for pretty much any bunch formation in the game. It's pretty good against any of those. And it's also decent against trip style formations as well. Um, you can also flip this same exact defense for trips, but just instead of quarter quarter having the trip side, quarter quarter half the tight end side. Thanks for watching the video. I hope that this was helpful. And if you want to check out my all of my offensive and defensive ebooks, make sure to join the school site. The link is in the description below.